BronxNet cameras had the opportunity to visit one of New York's finest Irish gift shops. Uh, let's take a look. My name is Marianne Connaughton. We're here at Marianne's Irish Gift Shop, right next door to the Riverdale Steakhouse, my mom and dad's place, where you can get an amazing pint of Guinness. And you can sit and sip that Guinness while I wrap your goodies. So I've been trekking over to Ireland for 26 years. I've established relationships with all of the artists that I buy from bring in a lot more knitwear, a lot of pottery, and more of just the handmade items that you don't find everywhere. So I love the textiles that come out of Ireland. They make these great tweed caps up in Donegal. What they're famous for, if you can see the different flecks of color, these tweeds are known around the world. This is a classic Aran sweater. The fishermen that lived on the Aran Islands, they would wear these sweaters going off to, to sea, and each family that knit theirs, they would have a different stitching. So if anything happened to them at sea, if they got lost at sea, they would be able to recognize who they were right away by their jumper. This is a really old, ancient technique that Nicholas Moss started. I even love these for Christmas, and I have customers that have even some of these really charming reindeer pieces that they use all year round. I have customers that come to me every Christmas. I wrap everything, keep track of what, what people have gotten. They always get something new. The orange though, I think the orange would be beautiful. I just love it here. Everything is imported from Ireland. You can't find this stuff anywhere else. I got a hand printed like silk scarf, a bangle with the Celtic knot, and also a beautiful handmade, hand-painted bowl that has like copper on the outside. Gorgeous. Well, I found two fisherman knit sweaters, which were traditional Irish sweaters, handmade, one for my new godson, so this is 18 month size, and one for his father. I think they'll look very handsome, don't you? They're going under the Christmas tree. <laughs> I sell to everybody. You don't have to be Irish to come in here. You just have to love unique and special items. So whether it be $20 or $200, you know, you're gonna get a handmade piece from Ireland. Hello and welcome back. Introducing Mary Ann owner of Marianne Fine Clothing and Gift Shop that has been the staple place for the past 20 years to get some of the most well, uh, qu uh, best quality gifts imported from Ireland. And her store has everything from hand knitted sweaters to hand painted pottery and jewelry, as you just saw. And so the Irish store itself has the essentials for like big events such as communions, birthdays and weddings. And she's going to basically give us a little demonstration about everything uh, she, well, not everything, some items that she has at uh, New York's renowned gift shop, Marianne's Fine Clothing and Gifts. And so that was a really long introduction. However, I wanted to make sure that everybody gets that all of these items are imported from Ireland. Hello and welcome. Hi, Lena. Thank you for having me. Thank you for being here in studio with us. And, um, Thank you for bringing all this beautiful work. And um, most importantly, I want to thank her for being my uh, stylist today because this fabulous hat I've been wearing all day and this amazing collar is uh, from her store. Can you tell us, let's start? can we start there and tell us sure. a little bit about these sure. items? These are um, hand uh, loomed in, in Claire in Ireland. I'm wearing one of the artist's uh, sweaters as well. Her name is Anya Knitwear. Um, I've been carrying her work since she started about 10 years ago. She's a, a lovely young woman who does amazing work and she started out with this signature hat of hers and then she's expanding into the collar and now knitwear getting it, like. <laughs> and some um, even uh, goods for, for the home. I'm, I'm pushing her hair off the flower because this is, it seems to be the signature piece to this artist mm -hmm. and she's in Ireland. Yes. Yes. Mm -hmm. And I love this hat and it totally like woke up my outfit this morning. So thank you for allowing me to wear it throughout the entire show. And so these are just some of the items that you can get at her gift shop. And so what else do we have here? 
Okay, so um, I carry a lot of um, just beautifully handcrafted items, but I thought being that we were in March, it would be a good idea to bring some of the, the green for St. Patrick's Day. Um, all of these, um, uh, most of these items are inspired by the Book of Kells and all of this artwork can I'm waiting. be found. Yeah, okay, let's put, put in, it up a little bit so that, In yeah. Trinity College. There we go. Mm -hmm. So all of these intricate panels are all taken they're all, um, they adorn the pages of this, um, this book that uh, is housed in Trinity College. And you'll see it on, like even here, there's a tie that the men wear, and this is a little Trinity knot, which is a symbol of eternity, no beginning, no end. You see that? Yes, this is hand -woven I see it. Silk. That's something I'm learning today. It, ha it almost looks like a pyramid, but it, it's, it, it's not. It's what's it called again? It's called a Trinity knot. The Trinity knot. Yep, I like there's that. Uh, three points. And this also, again, another piece that has uh, the Book of Kells inspired uh, design on it. You'll see a lot of animals and interwoven uh, panels, that, which are all symbols of eternity. No beginning, no end. And then, of course, we have these adorable little hand knit sweaters oh, for oh babies. Oh my gosh. Ah. I remember when my little one was that booties. small. Oh my gosh. And what's this little, little booties? Little baby booties. Oh my goodness. Mm -hmm. this is, and this is from Ireland too? These are all hand knit in Ireland. Oh my yeah. goodness. Okay. A little blanket, baby blanket. Let's, and this it's is the baby to, blanket? Yes. To wrap? Mm -hmm. Oh my goodness. Love this. Yeah. Oh my goodness. And it has little sheep. A little tam shanter you know, we have these for, for adults and children, and there's all, the, in Ireland, um, they're noted for their, their weaving. That's uh, all of these different colors. Um, you'll see here in these, these scarves, I have another one over here. That's what makes them so beautiful and so unique. Are, um, are the vibrant colors. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. I'm in awe. I love scarves and I, I love ponchos and I love some more hats. And some hats. Tweed yes. Hats. I'm like shopping here with my eyes. Let me see. Oh, very cool. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So um, I even brought some, some jewelry, some bangles with also, again, we have the Celtic knotwork. And these are great. You can wear it with the color without switch it around. They just look. Uh, Ex, you know, oh, dress that's up so any cool. Outfit. Mm -hmm. All right, so it could just be plain silver, mm -hmm. and or if you put this on, then it the has... The leather piece that comes in, it you comes can wear it with the green. And then it has the green inside of it. Or you can wear it with the blue yeah. in the reverse. And oh, then, nice. I'm putting it on. Okay. <laughs> well, I'm dressing myself we, up today. <laughs> <laughs> we have these... Uh, have you seen my earrings? The... These I don't are know all going to be able to do a close up well, on that, okay but it's, these they're really all, pretty. Is that the what is this that? This is all um, enamel and um, hand baked on on copper. A mother daughter team, also in Ireland, in in um, Westmeath, right? And they do these beautiful, and no piece is the same. Um, these earrings. Uh, bowls. She and even the, does right, hand the, the earrings silk. match it, right? It yeah. has like a, it's a, and so this is also, this also comes from Ireland. Yes, mm -hmm. all handmade. And then uh, we have these traditional Aran sweaters for men and women. And you, a lot, uh, these are also very popular to wear around St. Patrick's Day. Everybody knows, you know, this is the Irish sweater. This is the they Irish were worn, sweater. Why, yeah. are they the, why is this they the were, Irish sweater? They were worn on the Aran Islands by the fishermen when they would go out to, to sea. Each family had a different uh, knit. So this is the uh, the cable switch and the di uh, stitch and the diamond stitch. So so they all have a meaning too. They all have a meaning, which is great. And if they were lost at sea, they would be able to tell um, who who it was by the jumper that they were wearing. Interesting. Yeah. So I we have this. them. Mm -hmm. So we have those, and this I, is a man's. I, I love learning about just different cultures and oh, symbolism. Oh, so great. Yes. So back in the old days, these were um, wool. Uh, heavy, scratchy, you know, but nowadays the, the yarn that they use is much finer and softer, so they're, uh, they're comfortable and warm. They to look wear. comfortable. They, they, they look like I just want to wear them all day, every day. Yeah, these are great. And these are men's, um, the tweed caps for men, which is all, they're also notorious, the Irish men. Everybody wears these all day, every day, no matter what you're wearing. They'll wear them on the farm, going to church, you know. 
And um, so that's a big and then um, I wanted to go item. over this before we go. These um, are great. Well, I, no, I meant the ceramic. Right? Oh, okay. You, well, these two. These, these are, uh, these are okay, like gloves. These are little, little hand warmers. Uh -huh. We have um, lots of the hand warmers pieces without like that. fingers, right? Mm -hmm. And again, you'll see the little cable, the Aran sweater. So uh, they take it right from the so sweaters and bring it, the it into right Does into it the like this, right? Yeah. Them like that. Exactly. Oh my gosh, it's like leg warmers except they're hand warmers. How fabulous! Like. So you told me that you had a friend in Kilkenny. Yes, my girlfriend Siobhan, mm -hmm. who's my dear friend from Kilkenny, Ireland. So we have a lot of crafts actually that come out of Kilkenny. And um, this is one of them. This is Nicholas Moss Pottery, which we carry a full line of. And each of these pieces are all um, made from start to finish with clay. There is a 20 step process just to make the mug. Yeah, I just wanted and to show them so it's that it's all you know, hand sponge painted. So each piece is individually thrown, and then um, it's got to get dipped. And each um, flower is hand painted on. Same thing, bowl inside and out. So there's you know a ton of work that goes into each of these pieces, and they're all right here in the Bronx. I love that, yeah. and you can tell you can tell the quality. Mm -hmm. um, you can tell the care. You can tell they all come with their own energy. To be very honest with you, because I can feel the love in all of your items. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I handpick everything. Um, I go um, once a year um, to a show and find all of these great items. Uh, many of the artists I've been using for years, like um, uh, the Anya knitwear. Anya. And, okay. um, and then um, and then we, and have then we also have some jewelry. And this is the Clada, which is a symbol of friendship, loyalty, and love. And that's been around for a very long time. And people are, um, they know this, this oh item. But they, they, you know, they do it um, with some stones in it. and. All right. Yeah. yeah. Well, so. I like it. Love it. Love mm -hmm. it. She's going to be my new friend. That means I'm leaving with one of these. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you so oh, much, Mary Ann. My pleasure Anne. to be here. Thank oh you gosh, so much for awesome all that you that? do. How awesome was that? We just got an, uh, uh, a nice Irish uh, short, quick uh, history lesson mm -hmm. and in celebration of Irish Heritage Month. And once again, you guys, to get some of these beautiful gifts, visit Mary Ann Fine Clothing and Gift Shop, which is located at 5694 Riverdale Avenue in Riverdale, New York, of course. And uh, you can always w visit her website by going to maryannsgiftshop.com, maryannsgiftshop.com. That is our show today, mi gente. Thanks to all our guests for coming through and to you, our viewers, for tuning in. If you missed any part of the show, you can check out the Recable Cast tonight in 24 hours a day at broxnet.tv. I'm Rena Valenti, and from all of us here at Open, may the universe provide paz, prosperity, y amor, and to all our Irish friends, Happy Irish Heritage Month. <laughs> and to all the ladies, happy Women's History Month. Mwah. Adios.